What's up, everybody? It's me, Greg Miller, alongside the Pride of Long Island, Colin Moriarty. Hello, Greg. Look at that logo. Ooh, we haven't seen that in a while. It gives you the chills down your spine, it Colin, does. when it's it comes very to exciting. Masters of the Craft Media Molecule uh, coming out. Masters of Weird, and no doubt about it. This triple A dream game. What the hell do you think this is about? I don't know. I think that this is clearly the game that they showed at the PS3 or the PS4 reveal. When you were the dancing clay man and yeah. all these different things? This is just an iteration of that game, I think. I mean, I think it's pretty obvious. Yeah. Um, and they said that they've been working on it for four years. It was clear that Tearaway was a small team and that there was kind of a stopgap game, and it seems like bringing that to PS4 is even another stopgap for the studio while they figure this out. This game is exactly what you would expect from Media Molecule, and they're getting weirder and See, weirder and weirder like, as time goes on. That that Not is definitely the, the case. Yeah, but I mean, well, this one we talked about a little bit when we did our E3 wrap up games cast right over on youtubecom slash games is the fact that it's yeah. I think Media Molecule, when you look at this trailer, when you look at this game, when you talk to them about games, like they are, you know, at the forefront of games are art, and we are doing expressive, amazing things with it. My question watching this, and even what, like, this is still the trailer, right? When we got to see a little bit of the demo when he was drawing on the screen with the, making these, like, weird ass, like, basically ice cream. Like, you know, it mm -hmm. made me want soft serve ice cream. Okay. When he's Surprising. Everything makes me want a soft serve ice cream. When you're seeing that, it's just like, I don't know how to pitch that to somebody that that's a game you need to buy. And granted, this is first blush, this is first trailer, there's more to come. But, like, you're puppeteering these things, and you're making dreams, and we're sharing dreams, and I can see your dream, and it's like, what the hell are you talking about? Yeah, I mean, in, in, in reality, I'm so interested to sit down and talk to Shaban or one of the people, Rex, one of the people from Media Molecule that we know, and just be like, so what the hell is it? Because yeah. this is a game that you're, they're going to need to sit down and figure out how to tell people. I, I have no doubt that the core of this game... It's going to be great. Yeah. And it's going to be something interesting and different because that's what Media Molecule does. That's what they did with Little Big Planet. That's what they did with Tearaway. But how are they going to express what this is? Right. That's a huge problem. Like, I had no idea really what the hell they were talking about. I was just excited to see the Media Molecule logo for the first time in forever. <laughs> <laughs> you know, so I had really so they said they're gonna be a Paris Game Show, and we'll see. You know, you know that or Games Week, and that's later this year. Um, they have to figure out a message for this very, very, very soon. Right. Um, this should be. This has Morpheus written all over it too, um, in my opinion. Even though they didn't mm. say that, mm. that uh, was one of your predictions. But that it's about yeah, creating dreams and interconnect and, and, and dreams being interconnected. And I understand what they're saying in essence. They're, they're basically saying your dreams are weird. Yeah. And there are no rules. Yeah. Um, and that sounds great, but. It's very abstract if you're not there. This is a game that seems to have been made in a silo in a way, you know, because of course uh, they need to be able to message this to other people. Yeah, and I mean that's the alarming thing of like, the, like it's just even this thing of like is the you see the polar bear and we come back and the polar bear's head is on the guy who's playing piano and it's just like what the hell's going on? I like on? The, I like this part though. It's my favorite part when the when the when the, the little bear pup oh. or whatever you would call it yeah pops up starts licking him. That's how me and Porty sleep every night. So cute. You could be a part of that if you wanted. I could be, but you I, stay I, I, on, I You stay in your be. room, and then I could come in and suck the sun like that. I don't even know. Do you think – this is something you brought up that was interesting. I mean, like, as Media Molecule continues to get weirder and weirder, do you think Sony ever has to step in and rein them in? Like, you talked about it, right? Big, little Big Planet, the original – was a success because it was a platform where people could wrap their head around. It had a cute little guy, and then they that success kind of kept running and running and running to making crazier and crazier things. So now we're here. Yeah, I, d I it's clearly Sony's not reining them in. Yeah. So, but if this doesn't sell, do they rein them in? If this doesn't sell, I'd be really afraid for Media Molecule because yeah. you know it, I mean that's just the reality of the business, business. today and, and the way Sony treats their studios now. There's no room for for a big flops or whatever. And I'm not saying that this is necessarily gonna be a big flop, but this has this has commercial failure written on it if they don't if they don't you know communicate it effectively that's my yeah. major concern with this game communicate it effectively media molecule has all the talent in the world everyone knows that yeah. you know so figure it out and, and message the game and, and and so like there's little else to say because we don't even know what the hell it is yeah yeah final question for you colin yeah if it is a morpheus title when do they reveal that it's a morpheus title probably paris i'm sure we're gonna learn a lot more about the game of paris mm -hmm. i'm sure that with quantic dreams game is gonna be probably the marquee at that yeah. for sony would assume david cage man Ladies and gentlemen, this is dreams, and they're weird. Let us know what you think and get ready for all sorts of cool coverage from us at GameSpot.com slash E3.